Good morning friends. Today we are going to cook egg curry, egg and potato curry. So first we put water for boiling. We put eggs inside to boil the eggs. We want them to hard boil. I'm putting inside six, seven, eight eggs and three potatoes. And we want to boil them till they are done. While the potatoes and eggs are getting boiled, so we are going to use five dry chilies, some garlic, ginger, and one tomato. We're going to take all these things. We're going to clean it, wash, and make it into a paste. We're going to take two onions. We're going to chop them, slice them thin slices, and we get. Start getting prepared to cook the curry. Now our eggs already boiled, so we take our eggs out. We let the potatoes to boil. Because potato take longer than the eggs. Now let's start making the egg curry. So first we put oil in the pan. Now we are going to put some onion inside which we cut like this, long pieces. Fry till they are light brown. Our onions are the brown, they are golden brown. Just now we blend the garlic, ginger, chili powder, chili cream, and one tomato. about 5 minutes. Now the masala is cooked. We put in salt to taste. Salt to taste. Half a spoon of turmeric powder. One spoon chili powder, two spoons of curry powder. I'm using the chicken curry powder. Baba's brenna. So you mix them. Put some water. After five minutes, you can see all the mia pachardi. So we're going to do is we're going to take the down ketumba, we are only going to use the sticks on it. Need the down ketumba sticks. Our three potato which we just boil. Now we smash them. 
We don't smash that a lot, roughly smash on it. Okay, and I put, put in the curry. Put some water inside. See how much of gravy you want. Now cover it, cover the curry and let it cook for 10 minutes on medium heat. And the curry is finished. Curry is done. So just take eggs, put your eggs inside, the chicken eggs, put the chicken eggs inside. <laughs> Chili paddy and then coriander leaves down katumba. Cover it for five minutes. After five minutes, your curry is done. After five minutes, your curry is done. Off the stove. You see how the gravy is cut. It's very thick. Very thick and nice gravy. Come, let's enjoy lunch now. I'm going to go and have my lunch. Try this recipe, it's very delicious. And thank you for watching.